perfect. That is, you couldn't place the ball better. Today we are out here at Jamera Golf Estates, the Earth Course, which is one of the most famous golf courses in Dubai. They hold the race to Dubai here. Lots of legends have won the tournament at this course right here today. I think Tommy Fleetwood, Colin Morikawa, Rory McIlroy, tons of guys. John Rahm actually won it here as well. So lots of legends. There's a kitty cat on the tee box. I'm highly allergic to him. Today we get the opportunity to play this golf course. We're going to be holding the first round here today. Jamaica Golf Estates, the Earth Course. This might be a new strategy. We just play six holes at a bunch of different courses. It's cool, it's different. I hope you guys enjoy this. It's a different format, three separate videos, this video and the next two, boom, boom, boom. Instead of flipping a tee to see who goes first, we're going in order of the ranking of the last major, if that makes sense. So Bubby got last, which means he's going first. Steve got second to last, he's going second, Matt, third. Quan obviously is first, so he's going last, and then I'm going second to last. All right, y'all, thank you guys for tuning in. Hole one here, is it a par 4G, 454 yards? I don't know if those bunkers are, bunkers are reachable or not, so I'm just gonna hit driver. My day's already been made. Any animal I meet that I don't have a name for, I just call it Chester. I was just petting Chester for like 10 minutes before we tee off, so yeah, I'm gonna have a good day out here. First six holes, let's get to it. Perfect. That is, you couldn't place the ball better. Do you have to carry that? No. It's like 260 carry. Damn. You could not place the golf ball better. That is where you need to hit it. It's a good feeling when you step up to the first tee and have the wind behind your back. It's going to be some shots of the wind eight behind my back, Tay. We're going to work our way through those. All right, we're starting it off hot, boys. Oh, oh ball. I believe that's perfect. One for one. Wow. Mm. It's a good stuff for the underdogs there. What's everyone hitting today? Callaway one. Mine's LS. I got SC on it. Black. Mine's an LS too. All right, Schnarf. Little driver here. I don't think that bunker's reachable. Well, actually, I do think it's only 294 from the range bunker. Yep, that is so good. It's gonna get right around it, huh? You're still good. All right. Dang it, that was a terrible kick. Swing change on the range. We'll see how it pays off today. I'm trying to get my lower body more engaged, so we'll see. Driver in hand as well. Great tee shots, boys. What are you doing with your right foot there? I'm trying to get my lower body more engaged so I don't get stuck. I think it's the play, honestly. We'll see how it pays off. I'm not really sure if driver's the play, but hopefully it doesn't go too far in the bunker. I don't think it will. Dang. All right, that's a good first tee shot, boys. What'd I say? Shouldn't hit driver. <laughs> oh well. I got the hardest shot in golf now. Guys, we might have to switch up our filming format a little bit today because we've been told that we're probably gonna have to split up. It's just club rules out here at Jamaica Golf States, which is totally understandable. Which means after this first hole, me and Quan might have to go ahead, split up, or we'll see what the, what the pairings are gonna be, if you will. But I mean, yeah, first hole, everyone had a great start here. Everyone hit a good tee shot. Pretty impressive. Good, good major Dubai. It's gonna be cool and it's gonna be very different because, again, we're playing 18 holes over the span of three different courses. That's a genius idea, Colin, honestly. All right, since it did just rain about a couple hours ago, we are playing lift clean in place everywhere. It's also this why is, we have no carts. It's also why we have no carts. Kind of an unfortunate start for me. I mean, I thought I, I hit a really good drive, which I did, but got an unfortunate kick off this hill. Now I gotta play a little bit of a draw situation with the right hand bunker here, got 150. Gonna be interesting. Oh, 
It didn't draw it at all. I think I should have clubbed up. That probably would have helped. I should have hit nine iron instead of P wedge. All right, y'all, coming up to my ball here on the left side of the fairway. I've got 105 yards left to the pin, 91 yards to carry that bunker. So this is a really tough starting pin. If I was smart, I'd probably aim left, but I want to go right at it, see if we can make some birdies. My quota, one birdie per 18 holes. That's a quota I set for myself. Let's see if we can get it here early. Shot, Moby. Thank you, brother. We have no sand. Thank you. Just in the fairway here. 120 yards downwind, trying to carry this to the pin. Pretty straightaway shot, kind of tucked pin, so. 54 in the door. Oh, tough to get it. That looks good. The shot, G. Is that long? I don't know, it looks pretty good to me. I think it is long, but nice shot. Good first, first wedge swing of the day. Swing change, I guess, slightly working, which is cool. All right, Max, we found the uh, fairway bunker right in the middle. Got 115 to the flag, 100 to carry the uh, bunker. All I'm honestly thinking of is just trying to carry that front edge of the bunker because we're kind of downwind. So as long as I do that, I should be good. Nice shot, Luke. Hopefully that doesn't spin too much, but it looks pretty good. Ah, I got some tough decisions to make now. Do I land it at Bubby's ball? Just hopefully land it on the green so it doesn't move? Do I go a little bit left, try and land it just short, let it try and roll? I mean, I don't know. Great shot, Matt. It got the best of me. I thought I, I, I thought it hit a, a nine iron, but I've been hitting everything short, so I gotta get up and down. I thought I, I thought I did good. Look, I've really been practicing with this. It's not very good, but I'm gonna try to get it close and make a par. Interesting, it worked out. I actually think my putt's gonna move slightly to the right off my feet with this little hill right here. But yeah, he's right, it's gonna go left at the end there. The speed of the greens look pretty solid though. Their make speed. Their make speed? Their make speed. What's that? Like 10 and a half, 11. That just means that it's just a good solid like you, you don't have ram to, it in the back. No, you don't have to like hit it too hard. It's just like a good comfortable speed. It's gonna come left. Oh, it came. Mm. Wow. All right, I gotta take this way up there. Mine doesn't go right as much as Quan's did off the feet, so just gotta trust it. Uh oh. Nice oh, G. It's a birdie there, brother. Feels good. Left. Birdie in Dubai. Shout out to Dubai. Appreciate it. Uh, I kind of need this. Oh, nice wow, that's a save. Easy. Yeah. Nice putt. Thank you. Freak, I needed that. All right, y'all, this would be big for myself. Meet my quota on the first day. One birdie through 18, that's all I'm asking. Inside right, I think. Let's hit a good putt, see if it falls. Today, I am bubbly. Yeah, nice oh birdie. Boy. Nice, ah. oh boy. Can't just let me have the lead for one hole? Hey, just well, one hole? You do have the lead. You're tied to the lead. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, that's good. All right, we're, we're splitting up, me and Garrett, and then Matt, Luke, and Bubby. We're gonna try to play pretty quick and uh, see what happens. Shot, see you. Alright. Good work, boys. Well, uh, we'll be quick, boys. 239 into the breeze off the left. I'm gonna hit a little um, hybrid. Free. Nice. 
that'll be interesting, but it is par five. <laughs> all right, okay, let's go, up to, let's go up to my ball, why don't we, brother? Woo! Beautiful day in Dubai. It was supposed to rain all day, hoping that I don't jinx it. And the rain stays away. Steve had, where'd you hit it? Right. Steve hit a little bit right. We have 239 from our balls, or Steve had 239 from his ball. I have 210, so we are playing lift, clean, and play stakes. It's been raining a ton in Dubai. 210. I got a six iron here, guys. Trying to hit a fade off the left. Actually, we're gonna hit an easy five iron. Open it up, hit that fade. Come on close, let's make an eagle here. Oh, too much fade. Yikes, that was bad. Oh, that's not gonna be good over there. Oh, that's just a stupid mistake. There's the world left, and I missed right. But, it's okay. I will say, like, the idea of this swing change is, like, most pro golfers activate their lower body, and it's a good sequence between their upper and lower body. For me, you guys watch my golf swing. I've never been that way, and I get stuck in flippy. So, if you do see misses today, most likely you will see me miss it right, because essentially, it's avoiding that flip shot. What you guys see, like my duck hooks, that's because I'm flipping my hands at it and getting quick on my transition. So, with all that being said, as long as I have a one-way miss today, I can play with that. I can play golf like that. It's just once you, once you start playing army golf, left, right, left, that's when you start struggling. I went right, so I'm gonna try to find it. I mean, it's not out of play, but I don't know where it's at. So, we're gonna see. Oh, right over there. Perfect. Yeah, I played it 30. <laughs> I don't know what it was. I played that way too hard. I played it 40, not 30. Sit down right rough. Downhill eye, kind of an interesting one, but if I give myself a good, good look inside of five feet, 10 feet, I'll be happy. You gotta, it's somewhat of a flap shot here. Shot. Stay, stay on this side of the ridge. Okay. That was a tough one to stop, so I'm honestly not too upset about that. It's one that can definitely either one get away from you or you can chunk it and leave it short. So, see if we can make another putt. All right, I got a birdie look. Not a very good one, but this, this is completely just trying to get a par. Jim's gonna start going left again, see that? I think I got an idea from Steve's putt. Mine should go a little right to left. Which is slightly deceiving, but you just gotta trust it. Oh, it went a lot right to left. Holy crap. That's good. That good? Alright. Thanks. Alright. And for par, that's I gotta say, after that tee shot, that is the stupidest mistake. On a hole like that. From where we hit our tee shots, you should make birdie at least hopefully five times, six, seven times out of 10, because it's just, it's too prime position to be making pars. It feels like a boat. All right, y'all, we saw to do from Garrett and Steve. They both hit some great jives. Let's try and do the same thing here. Right over that bunker, fairway, green, putt, carry on the whole three. It's gonna be close to that bunker. It's Good gonna swing be, though. It's gonna be real close. All right, I'm just going at where Bubby ended up with a cut. Hopefully it cuts. Somewhere down, down yonder. Should be short. Okay. All right, well, it's 266 to the pin. <sighs> I don't think I have enough in my two iron to get there. Of course, three wood's a little too much, so I guess if I get in that bunker, I'll be all right, but there's no water, so I should be good.
All right, all right, all right, y'all. We found the left rough right here. I got 251 to the pin, 236 carry that bunker, wind at the back, jumper line. I got five iron. Let's see if she gets on up there. Go. Go, I caught it a groove low. It's right at it. I think it's short. Short of the bunker? Uh, no, I think it's short in the bunker. Hey, I hit a good shot. It was right at it. It was checking a pin. That's all you can ask for. Go up there, work with what you got. 195 might be a little short, but we're gonna go with it. Hopefully this one helps out the ball a little bit. Oh boy, that's all right. I hit the crap out of that thing though. It was flushed. Scored it to the right, just a hair. Well, Max, you were right. I was wrong. I thought it went long to the green. Max said I went short of the green. Ended up coming up just short here in the bunker. I don't think that lip right there is gonna be too much of a problem. So open up the face, plop it out on the green, do your business with the flat stick, on to the next. Hey, that's not bad there, buddy. I'll take that, brother. Thank you. Good. Thank you. If I keep giving myself birdie putts, I'll be very happy with the day. Be happy with the day anyways. I'm in Dubai playing golf. Some of uh, some of my some some of uh, my bam, some of my kick back down off the mulch here, so got a little lucky break, but again, kind of a tough shot. I'm just gonna give myself a decent birdie look here. Nice shot, man. There you go. Yeah, nice. Honestly, kind of a challenging shot here. Got a bit of a ridge to work with. It's kind of running away after the ridge, and I'm also coming out of this finicky uh, Bermuda stuff, so gotta try to judge it out of this thing correctly. Go. Go, 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 go. Uh, just came out soft, man. Guess what, Max? I'm still out. Gotta go again. Looking like a right to lefter, like 20 feet. Gotta make it. All right, y'all, we got like 10, 12 feet, somewhere around there for our birdie. Right to left, I think, seeing Luke's come down the hill. It's a good putt, see if finds the bottom of the cup. Oh, I babied it. I babied it. All good. I'll take cars all day. It's be a good one to make. It's be a good one to get one back up to the first hole. Alright, right, just inside the bunker on the right side is the goal. Ride the wind, a little bit of a draw. This is a very easy par four if you hit the fairway. If you hit a good tee shot, you'll have about 60, 70 yards in. Oh. Okay, never mind. Maybe I played the up tees last time I played. It's 452. So definitely not gonna have 60 yards. <laughs> That'll do. I did not try and do that. I pulled that about 20 yards. So that bunker on the right, like 10, 15 yards left of that's perfect. Short of it, maybe? Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. We'll see. I don't know. That, that might be in there, might not be. That's fine, though. Cart cam, cart cam's rolling. Cool cat, cart cam K. Yep, the swing change on the range. How's that going? It's good. What do we think about today with that swing change? Hey? It's good, yeah. I, I answered that one to Colin on the last hole. But oh. it's good. <laughs> All right, another question then. <laughs> okay. What do we think about the chess game recently? I know you've been working hard at that. Been working hard. Uh, Slowly improving. Used to play a lot of chess back in my day, back when I was 11, 12, 13 years old. But anyway, uh, started playing chess again, and I'm getting back into it. I'm trying to dial in the speed chess, you know? My brain doesn't work too fast sometimes. Right. I have ADHD, you know that? No. But what's your favorite moment on tour? Yeah. Perfect. Maybe not. Steve with a rangefinder out. Oh, this is new. 193. This is kind of weird. I don't have a, a pen. It's 
Steve, nice shot. On a little. A little left, but all right, pretty solid. 159, a little down breeze. I got a nine iron here, guys. I'm trying to hit this pretty full. I think this is the right club, but we'll see. Wind's kind of coming off the right. And uh, my goal is kind of to like just ride this wind on the right side. Oh, that's so long. Oh, it's a flyer. Steve, I'm joining you, brother. Oh. We'll that's the thing that I've noticed about Dubai golf courses is there's not much like hazards and OB and stuff like that. The real challenge to all the courses I've played is the rough. So if you miss the fairway, most of the time you're not getting a consistent lie. I'm going to the beach, you could say. So tournament mode is activated though, so I'm gonna get up and down. Okay. No spin. That's the difference right there, guys. It carried that nine iron probably 200 yards because it was a fly or lie. You catch some grass behind the ball and it just freaking goes. About 30 yards here, maybe 35, 40. So I'm going with the 50 degree. This is a pretty tough shot in the game of golf, they say. I'm trying to take this a little bit lower, though. Okay, that's what they call a little bunker to bunker action was left and then right. I'm gonna play it pretty straight. I'm just gonna try to get par out of this, which is the, the par putt. I just played the bunker this whole hole. Not fun. No. Yeah, this is the thing, that Kwan is probably gonna tear these courses up, so I need to do something. I can't be making mistakes like this, but it is what it is. Oh my lord. Mm, I knew it when I did. Oh. <sighs> That's such a stupid double bogey. Those are holes that you can't have today. You cannot have those. All right, hit hard, ball far, par four. How many yards is it? 452 yard, par four, straight away. Bunkers in play, ain't even thinking about it. Don't exist, whack it up there. Where'd that go? Right. That's right. How far right? Help it. Just left of that bunker. Oh. Kick left. Should be fine. Oh, far far I couldn't see it. It is? Yeah. Well, thank you, I'm glad to hear that. You don't know where the ball goes, he says it's perfect. A lot of other things that could have been said that are not as good as that. I'll take it. Thank you, brother. Well, obviously, I've never seen this course, but I can see a bunker over there, like 300, and I don't think it's driver. So, kind of learned my mistake on the first hole. Oh, boy. Win. 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 Oh, man. Oh, oh, I hit it so bad. Sometimes bad is good. That should be good, Matt. Good ball, brother. Perfect. Nice shot. Good hole. Well, not hole. Fortunately, I hit it bad enough. I'm not in this bunker. Unfortunately, I am further from the green. So you win some, you lose some. Just kind of, I don't know. It's got a longer shot, and I got 200 yards into the, into the green. Anything on the green, we can figure it out from there. Looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. I don't know if it's too far. It's on the green. We're putting. We're putting. Pretty decent drive here. I can't miss long and left. That's what I've heard. So I'm gonna keep up on that right side. Maybe it's a crosswind from right to left. So maybe if I if I catch it right and get a little bit of a draw, maybe we can get in there pretty tight. But I just want a good birdie putt again. We got a good bounce off the slope of the bunker, found the rough. To me, same thing as the fairway. I got 132 yards left. <laughs> gonna, gonna hit the ball up there, try and put it close, give ourselves another birdie putt. Work.
Oh, I did it, brother. I did it, didn't I? Wait, where'd he go? Left. I went long left. You gotta deal with that ridge along with me. I oh, went there long left. That was a good shot, though. That was right at it. Struck it well. I ain't gonna complain. Let's go grind out those putts, brother. As long as you hit the ball in play, everything's fairway, huh? For me, yeah. <laughs> as, long as, not, as long as there's not a tree in front of me, I don't, I, I don't care what ground you put me on. If it's a, it, it's only if it's a full swing. Yep. Like if it's a full swing on a bunker grass, I don't really care. Just hit the ball. <laughs> Nice shot, man. Real yeah, good golf good. shot. Well, I mean, I saw the ridge of the green back in the fairway. It's actually not, not terrible. I mean, it's definitely wouldn't say it's an easy putt, but we got to try to, you know, cozy, cozy this thing down there for an easy two putt here. Sit, sit, sit. Nice putt. All right, y'all. I did exactly what I was told not to do. I went long left. Now I got to go up and over a big ridge. It's kind of a baffling putt. Just gonna hit it up there, try and put it close, tap in for par, carry on to the next. Set. Same thing as you, Luke. Nice Ooh, nice. Matt. Good okay. sandy, brother. I'm not gonna lie, I don't really feel confident with this read, but we're gonna go inside left. Good Ooh, putt. Nice. Good putt. Good putt. Yeah, there you go. Good two go, boys. Good two Good putts. Two putts all around there. Two fifty one. It's a four iron though, Steve. It's downwind, downhill. It's. But I mean, it's only two seventeen to the front. You're trying to carry this like two fifteen. I'm hitting four iron, like, and I'm not hitting it hard. I was gonna hit a cut hybrid. All right, I, li I like this, Steve. Steve's going with the cut hybrid. This, 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 this. Bunker. Sir. All right, I played the cut, just not good. You know, I should have started at those trees and not in the center of the green. Mistakes have been made already. All right, here we go. Four iron in hand. Nice and smooth swing. Not trying to kill it, because it should get there no problem. It's almost a five iron, but I'm gonna just hit an easy four. This course is hard. It's so scorable, I will say it, it can be challenging, which obviously we've proven, but there's so many birdies on this course. It's crazy. That's not what you want to see, brother. Shot. It's very minimal sand. So I have to try and pick this one very clean and spin it. I mean, oh, this is a very damn, it's a tough shot. We'll just say that. Nice shot, Garrett. Oh I'm gonna break a freaking pull card. What are you doing, brother? I gotta put a bogey. That is quite literally as good as I could have done. So I am not upset with that at all. I think this goes right to left. But it, like it pops left at the start and then it almost straightens out. Man, is... mm. Grain's going that way. The slope's going that way. It's not too much to it, honestly. I need this, boys. crazy format because now we have two holes left like normally when you play a major you think like oh there's so much golf to be played there technically is but we have to go back sleep and wait a whole nother day <laughs> to play round two so it gives you the feeling of a tournament a little bit more all right, y'all, we're coming up. Is this hole four? Yes. All right, y'all, come up to hole four here. We got a 250 yard par three, 215 to carry that bunker. I have no clue. What I'm up, aren't I? All right, y'all, I'm going five iron. I'm thinking just carry that bunker, get it on, trickle on back, fall in the hole. 
That'd be something, wouldn't it? Oh, you no! I knew it was you six iron. With your gut. I knew it was six iron. That five iron just carried like two fifty five. <laughs> That's messed up, bro. That, I can't hey, complain. Hey, hey. Tell him it's downwind, downhill. Brother, it's uphill into the wind. <laughs> <laughs> just get, it's downhill, downwind. All right, I'm gonna go with a five. I originally had a four, but after seeing that, not anymore. Five. Cut. Oh, just stay on the green. There you go. Hey, we're putting. We're putting. Long par three is all you're looking for is a putter in your hand. All right, I got a little four iron. Sharp. Oh. That's got to be real good. Scar. That shot. Yeah, nice. Real oh, good. wow. Real nice. I'm in a tough spot here. Long of the green. Not in the deep rough, so I think I'm gonna try and put it up there. I got a bit of a backstop, it looks like. Aim left of that sprinkler head, let it scoot on up there. See if friction works properly and it does some good. Not bad. Not bad. Wow, that's really good for me. I couldn't have chipped it no better. I probably should have went with my instinct and go off the forearm. Bubby just freaked me out on the tee box and uh... Now we're on the front of the green. We got a big old ridge kind of on the left side of the flag here. If I was like right here, a little bit further to the left, I'd probably be chipping for the green. But let's try to go two for two on long putts here. Phenomenal positive. Sit. All right, well, I got a birdie putt here. I'm thinking it's just a little outside of right edge. I'm not sure how much this breaks. All right, I'm kind of confused on what this putt does. I think it goes left to right. Gonna play it inside left, hit a good putt, see if it goes in the hole. Oh, <gasps> Bubby. Oh, Bubby, that was so good. I couldn't believe that. I read that right, man. I can't believe that was the correct read. It did a snake. It went this way, then that way. It was a double breaker, brother. That's not too bad. You're actually falling today, I feel good. Let's see what Luke does. I mean, I'm seeing like inside the left. I have a hard time believing it. Nice putt. Yep. Yep. Wow. Can I help you? yep. Wow. I can't believe that. All right. Well, that's pars for me and Matt. Fortunately, unfortunately, Bubby, uh, bogey for Bubby, but he had a nice putt there. I can't believe that didn't go in. Hard par three, though. On to the next one. Double trouble, three over through four. Um, this course is so intimidating that every the bunker covers everything. I mean, it's a bunk, it's, you're pretty much just playing bunker course. It's that's the hardest part of this course for sure, is the bunkers. All right, I got driver trying to rip it up the right side a little bit. Just kind of bust on this one. That's so bad. Alright, this course is actually way harder than I remember. I don't know why. Well, tournament mode activated. Tournament <laughs> mode activated? You one kid. I want whatever that is. Yeah, you don't want it after a couple holes, brother. Yeah. I'm 57, oh. and I flew the 8 iron way long last time, but it's uphill. What's the slope? Probably playing like 100. Dude, minutes. these bunkers. 157? Playing 170. 7 iron. At least seven. I flew my eight iron last time, but I'll hit a seven. If you hit a seven iron long in the green. Oh, oh we're putting. <laughs> That's gonna be a long putt. Yeah, didn't think about that one. I freaking hooked, I literally, when you have that downhill lie, I always hit a freaking fade. So I was like, I'm gonna try to hook this in there. And I aimed left. Holy. It's 138, and I might be hitting 7 iron. That wind is... I have 8 iron. I'm gonna trust an 8 iron. Let's make a birdie. 
tools left. I want to get back even far. Two birdies finished. What the? Whoa! That jumped. That went a country mile and a half. This is something special, I'll tell you. This is all about pace. It's gonna go left off that hill and then back right. So, I don't know. It's gonna be a wonderful putt. I paced it all right. Freak! I'll go. Bogey, we're four over two five. Steven and I are really just bringing it up the rear right now. Having a tough round of golf. But if I can make this, that would really just change my point of view on the game. Gotta go left. It absolutely has to. Go. Whoa! <laughs> Two over par is just not good. Not good on any day of golf. But maybe they're playing bad too. You never know. Hole number five, uh, four, 407. The one on the right's reachable. I don't think the two up there, the one in the middle and then the one left of it are reachable. They're 323, so into the wind, I highly doubt you can get there, but. Oh yeah, I got driver. Hit it out there somewhere. Find it, hit it again. Uh, bunker's not thinking about him. Yeah. Oh, you scared that bird. That'll be fine, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah you're in the wood chips, so fairway? Fairway. <laughs> oh, that's perfect. It kicked down to the left a bit. Not a problem. Welcome back to another good, good major. <laughs> All right, that middle bunker's kinda in place. I'm gonna hit a little. Lower, low driver. That is so pretty, bro. Well, it's hey, leaked. Good work. ball. No, that should be good. That's a beautiful shot. Hey, 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 get out of the rough. What the heck? That's rough for me, not for you, Bubby. Yeah, Bubby. I don't like the rough. Carry it. Oh, good ball. Carried it. All right, y'all, I got 130 yards left. I got lucky enough, trickled back down into just the rough. Not the wood chips, all fairway though, none of the difference. Right into the wind, uphill. I hit a light P wedge. Oh, draw. Draw, it just stayed out there. Ah, should be about pin high. Probably got a putt or something of that nature. We'll see. All right, same number as Bubby here. Same club as well. Could be good, I have no idea. All right, Max, well, I'm, I'm slightly in the rough as well. So try not to get cute with it, 136. Front bunker's not really in play, just trying to hit it 136 with a nine iron. Oh God, sit. Sit, sit, sit. Good ball. All right, y'all, we actually hit a pretty good shot here. Just a bit right, had the right club. Let's see if we can chip one up there. I'm gonna kind of just land it short, let it scoot on up there. See if it gets close, make a putt. Carry on to the next hole. Thank you. I'm not too good at opening up the face, so I use my environment, my surroundings to my advantage. Hit that pin high, we've got a little left to rider. Whoa, there goes a gazelle. Go. All right. Hi, Luke. Keep trying. Oh, I knew it didn't break that much. All right, y'all just got a bit to clean up here. Let's knock it in the back of the cup, go on to the next hole. Oh. It, jumped. it jumped a little bit. Jumped. Found the bottom of the cup though. That's all that matters. Nope. On to the final hole of this video. Once we went to the pin, wind is a crosswind, but there's nothing going on at the actual pin, so 
I'm probably gonna hit a little hate iron. All right, I got a seven iron, trying to just cut one right at Cade. He is standing dangerously close there, brother. Heads up! I mean, that is literally my aiming point. Four! Oh my. All right, I already seven iron as well. That's good. Go. Yeah, this is good. Go. go, go, go. Alright. Hard hole. I caught it at about 15 grooves low. I always do that when I tee it up, so I need to probably stop digging it up. Alright, hat came off because I haven't been making anything. I'm going to putt this, just get it up there, and get out of here with a par, you know? It's kind of what I want to do. Get over with these six holes and get in the next course. How about I play a par three course and you guys play like a regular? <laughs> All right, all right, that's good. I'll hit it back. Yeah, right. needed that. Needed that, Steve. <laughs> oh, good catch, you freaking hole. Oh my God, Steve, you are playing like a trash mag. All right, y'all, final hole of the day here. We have a par three, 169 yards. Wind's hurting a little bit out the right. Yeah, I don't know, it's over water. Looks like a pretty tough hole. Pins in the front right. The wind is just what makes it a bit confusing here, y'all. I'm gonna not listen to what Bubby says, what club he's hitting, I'm gonna go with what I think. So I'm gonna hit a little, I don't know, I, go, go, I was thinking a full seven, I might hit it like slightly softer. Mm. Okay. All right. Wow. Pin Heisman, making Bubby go back to his bag. I like this. Scaring him, scaring him. Good shot there, brother. Oh, I'm excited to see that tracer. <laughs> that thing. That thing went up and swooped. That thing started way out to the right. That was barely even over the water. I scared you into hitting the air. You did. Get her. You did. <laughs> and nine was the club. You did good. All right, y'all, taking a look at this putt, trying to understand grain. I think it's gonna be moving a little bit left to right, down towards the water, but not a whole lot. Let's put a good roll on it, see what happens. I couldn't have had a straighter putt. Got a pin high here, like 15, 17 feet. It's been a very uneventful six holes here, so I'm gonna to try to make a, I would like a birdie here. Get it to the red numbers. Hey, Luke. Great putt, brother. Solid two right there. Good putt. Thank you. Oh, dang. That's a good par. There's just better work to clean up my par here. I think it's inside right. Put a good roll on it. Bubby. Thank you. Real nice. That feels good. Good Real playing. Nice. Good good round one. Good round one of the Good Good Major brought to y'all from Dubai. Yeah. Big thank you again to the Hero Dubai Desert Classic for having us out. Hey, y'all got two more videos, two more rounds of golf coming y'all's way. I hope y'all having a blessed day. Much love, y'all. There you go. <laughs> I missed that. <laughs>